started for you? Hi, could I please get a grande cold brew um, with extra ice? In that, could I get two pumps of white mocha and vanilla cream cold foam? I'll see you at the window, Rachel. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to the vlog. I'm so excited for today. Today's video is my bridal shower vlog, which is so fun. I feel like you wait for this for a long time, um, and I'm really excited. It's in Atlanta, so I'm currently in Atlanta. I drove home last night from Florida, and I stayed at Emily's house. I'm just, I just ran to get us a coffee. The party's from 12 to four i think we have the venue we're doing it in atlanta at a really cute studio i'm really excited to show you guys and my sister's party planning business wonderland parties is throwing she's like decorating the whole thing for me so i'm so excited to see it and i'm so excited to show and like share it with you guys very excited for today i'm excited to see my friends family just the whole nine yards so dylan's family will be there friends from the wedding it's basically like all the women from the wedding are coming minus like some family from up north because obviously they're not going to fly all the way here just for like a little three hour party so um they'll all be at the wedding though and i can't wait you guys the wedding's getting so close we're doing so many fun things for the wedding leading up to the wedding and i just like literally cannot believe how stinking close it is so i wanted to start the video getting em and i some coffee i'm gonna head home and kind of get ready i have to go run and get my nails done because they are like literally so tragic one of my nails is like broken and they're just like grown out and I just don't really want blue tips with my dress I'm wearing today. I'm excited to show you guys my dress and just the party and stuff. I'm also like, don't know what it's gonna look like or how it's gonna be decorated. I don't even really know the theme of it. So Sarah's like taking care of it all. So it's been so nice not having the stress about a bridal shower. So I'm very excited. I'm excited to bring you guys along. Um, but yeah, welcome back to the channel if you're new. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. We have a lot of fun stuff going on over here. So I'm gonna get coffee, go home. I'm gonna curl my hair before I go get nails because nails doesn't open till 10 o'clock. It's only nine o'clock right now. And then I think that's it. Sorry, my app's being slow. Okay, here we go. Thank you. This order right here is so good. Can't really read the label. It's a grande cold brew, sweet cream cold foam, extra ice two pumps of white milk it's like my go-to you guys need to try it it's so good first sip is always the best you guys i did so much cold foam this time it's so good you have to like really tip it to even get any coffee plan today is coffee check we have i need to go home do my hair i'm gonna go run get my nails done come back put my makeup on my dress and then go to the party and then once the party ends I'm gonna help with cleanup and then we have like drinks and dinner reservations at a cute place like near where the party is um, with all of my friends. But I gotta go because I was at a red light. So I will see you guys at home. My nails are done. I'm literally obsessed with this nail place I went to. It's called Allure Nails and Spots in like the Smyrna area if you guys live in Georgia. It's where Emily goes and they did such a good job. I love the shape, I love the length, they just look so good. So I'm very excited about this. I'm gonna go home, get ready. I need to do my makeup, steam my dress. We're good to go, I'm obsessed with my nails. Just got done steaming my dress. I'm so excited about this dress, it's super cute. I got it from For Love and Lemons. They came out with the bridal collection, you guys, and it is so good. They have so many different styles. Obviously pricier, but they're really, really great quality. I feel like when you're a bride too, you like to kind of like invest and splurge on your wedding event day dresses. So this one's really cute, the sleeves. But I'm gonna, I just steamed it all, and I'm just gonna bring it in the car because I don't wanna like sit in it and get it all wrinkled because there's like a long train on it and if you're having more of like a casual wedding this would be a really pretty like day of wedding dress honestly i was just being extra and like wanted a really fancy dress for my bridal shower but this could be really cute for wedding day emily just left to go help set up she had to go run some errands for my mom for some stuff sometimes it's nice when the party is about you you don't really have to like do much because they want it to be a surprise for me so i'm gonna come right when the party starts so i'm gonna do my makeup now my hair is all curled nails are done so just make up, I'm gonna bring my dress, and then we're all ready to go. This stuff, you guys, is literally such a game changer when it comes to makeup. If you have a good tan going on, apply it. 
um, I'm in shade 10. I just like mix it with my moisturizer. I do one pump. I showed this in like my everyday makeup routine. I included it in like a recent vlog, but it gives your skin like prettiest glow and color. Um, but I will say if you don't have as if you're if you're more like fair skinned, I would um, go down a shade or two. They have a bunch of different shades, but it's so good I don't even wear anything on my face anymore. Like, well, I guess I never really wore foundation, but I barely put any powder because I love like the glow that this gives my skin it's so good the combo of that mixed in with moisturizer with the kosas concealer is so good also this dibs beauty stick is incredible i'm in the shade two yeah i believe this is two and i take the beauty blender And it's so good. It's like so natural. It blends so easily. For the other side, I just take like a, this is the Sephora 64. And do the blush side of the stick and it's so pretty. I've like never been one to like um, cream products, but this is like a new go-to for me. Decided to go with my hair up. Because my dress has like really pretty sleeves, I thought it would be cute. And I feel like when my hair is out of my face, I just like it better. Um, but makeup's all ready. I just need to take a Q-tip and get the like mascara off the top of my eyelids. But I'm just letting it dry. That's like my little trick. But I'm going to put on my jewelry. And I quickly wanted to thank Orate for sponsoring today's video. You guys know the drill with my Orate jewelry. I love their rings. That's like my favorite thing from them. Um, but obviously I have like their earrings. Um, I have chain earrings. I'll like insert a photo. So cute. I'm waiting on like all my new piercings to heal so I can start like putting long chains to go with my hoops and stuff. I think that would be so cute, but I'm obsessed with Orate. They have the best quality jewelry at the most affordable price. I shower, sleep, swim, cook. I do everything in my jewelry and I've never had any problems. I've had some of these rings for like going on two years now. So I've been working with them for months now and I just like love what they stand for, their company, all that good stuff. I also love how there's no middleman markup, which is how and why you can get such good quality jewelry. This little ring I just put on is from them. I love this. I think it's called the Cigar Band, but you can get such good quality jewelry at such an affordable price because there's no middleman markup, which basically just means they sell directly to you without like that middleman. Um, they have the same quality jewelry as like those Fifth Avenue brands just without that price tag. So that's really really great and then also besides the transparent pricing or it has now teamed up with Klarna oh, hi Winnie to make their items even more accessible to you guys so you guys can get your Orate pieces now and pay over time with Klarna so I'll have all that information linked down below for you guys so for 20% off of your Orate purchase you can go to oratenewyork.com slash Rachel and use code Rachel and that is a-u-r-a-t-e newyork.com slash Rachel and the promo code is Rachel get you 20% off definitely check it out again it is oratenewyork.com slash Rachel and it's promo code Rachel for you guys there's holidays coming up Easter Mother's Day all that good stuff so check them out and I want to thank Orate for sponsoring the video. I'm going to get ready, get my stuff in the car, and I will see you guys at the um, bridal shower venue. I'm so excited to see it. And I'm going to be vlogging the party. So...
Should we do a confessional? What do you want to confess? <laughs> Aaron ate the entire cheese box in five minutes. It's pretty good lighting, Aaron. I might have to look at myself. You have to look here and not there at yourself. I know. You gotta look at the film. My voice. You just got my side Um, my voice is not always this manly. I have allergies, so don't make fun of me or bully me in the comments. Thanks. I, that's what I'm saying. Okay, go. Okay, wait. I'm gonna, I'm gonna vlog it. I have to get the sound. Oh, fuck. Wait, the whole, the whole camera, it wasn't even your face. It's okay. Look at my bag. Okay. I just changed. We're gonna go get drinks. Huh? Sarah, before Carson leaves, I need to say something. Looks like dough. Is that the cheese inside the cheese? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. 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 How to make an Aperol Spritz one on one. Aperol. I, oh, sorry. Excuse me. <laughs> I don't know if you use club soda or tonic or sparkling water. I don't know what the difference is between all of them, but we just got club soda. And then we got the champagne. I'm literally just hitting right in the center. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You guys know how I am with popping champagne, so let's see how this. I should pop it probably not in the house. Yeah. No, it doesn't matter. You gotta take this no, off no, first. I know, but I thought you were gonna like. You have to hold the cork and you have to pull it down. Yes. Pull down the twist. Oh, you can do it. It's fine. It might go through the ceiling. I'm gonna go this way. Take out a light. Ready, Emily? Watch out. You need to hold onto the. You're pushing it. What do you do? You oh, you're to, fine. You have to pull on and pull down. See. Oh, oh. hell. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Ew! The dogs! Ew! You just said there's shit on the floor. Like, yeah, that's gross. Ew, I'm sorry. I like Prosecco better, I think. <laughs> I'm like, do you even like Aperol Spritz? Why do you want one? I do like Aperol Spritz. You do? I don't really like soda, water. Yeah, actually, I don't know, know if you're supposed to even put that in it. It might be good with just this. Well, that's what I was saying. If I was to make it, I would literally just put champagne and... We'll try it. I did not clean that up all that. Mm -hmm. You kind of just spread that it. That was my first bottle of champagne I've actually ever popped. No, it's not. Yes, it is. I you never popped a bottle of champagne um, outside of Sarah's one time. That was good practice for the wedding. Outside of Sarah's? No, that wasn't me. Remember, I didn't do it. Oh, yeah, Dylan ended up there. Yeah, I always like get scared. <laughs> it's a lot of champagne. That's why I think That's you're supposed to add the soda water. I probably, okay, I'm not even going to try it. I probably, you don't like I don't, champagne? I don't like no, soda totally water. I don't like soda water or tonic. Who wants club soda? I might try it. Am I one at the restaurant? Oh, and we're supposed to have fresh orange. Do you have that? That does not taste good at Aperol's. It does it? <laughs> Wait, maybe don't copy my recipe. Does it have to be like majority of this on mine? Yeah. Not today. Oh. Not too much soda water. <laughs> what was that noise? Wait, why were you... No, it I don't really like soda water. Well, I don't think that I made this right. You guys. didn't even put that on. <laughs> <laughs> Ew. 
it's fine. It's like average. Like this was this would be at like a sports bar compared to like a nice restaurant. This is a nice restaurant. This is a Denny's after all. <laughs> My this house is, is Golden not Corral. A Denny's. No, no, this no, is yeah, Golden no, Corral. Maybe if we put more of the Aperol, right? I, I put them on. Or what about some... No, um, do you, you have do, fresh orange you juice? Need more of that. Oh, I do have fresh orange juice. No, not like literal orange juice, but like no, orange juice. That would be good. I got the good kind. Okay, you try it. I'm not going to ruin mine. This is, our, this, is the best or, this is the best orange juice. Rachel, right? Yes. Back me up. Show it like how you, how you would. Okay, <laughs> we are going to have a drink at Emily's house, and then we're going to go to the battery. We're going to Uber there in like 30 minutes. I'm on a roll with these voice texts. It looks not good. What? It's the it's the club soda. That's what I don't like. About it. it might be good. Oh, way better. It is. Yeah. Good. Yeah. <laughs> good orange juice. Mm -hmm. Like how much? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why is it even Girl. Are you just not gonna like pour it in my drink? Well, I didn't That's want. Way better. Amanda said, "Okay, so battery around eight. What time is it? I would say eight thirty. <gasps> oh, she almost broke glass. Is that why I did glass? I didn't break it. I caught almost. it. My sport, like athletic reflexes. You danced. <laughs> That's a sport. You, yeah, the orange juice is good. Cheers. Sport, wait, wait. Right in front of the camera, big clink. What? That I can chill it. Emily got this 818 tequila. I told her to get it. I'm not a big tequila fan, but this one's actually really good. What is it? The that it, reposado. Yeah, yeah. It's really good. Okay, I'm gonna chill it because I like y'all. Never serve hot tequila. I don't really want to take a shot. I think I changed my mind. I need to get a shaker. Okay. A cigar whiskey. <laughs> Better than I ever. Okay, it's the smallest one. I've been home for a little bit. I just got out of the shower and stuff and took a little nap. I was kind of tired from last night, but we're back in Nashville and Dylan got me flowers. Who's we? You said we're back in Nashville. The dogs. Oh, okay. I don't know why I said we. <laughs> I wanted to show you guys this cross that my grandma gave me at the bridal shower yesterday. I think it's so pretty. I don't know where I'm going to set it yet in the house. I have it just sitting here because I didn't want it to break in the bag. But I've kind of just been unpacking and organizing. And I also wanted to share because I feel like I didn't. Like, I also sound sick because allergies are kicking in. But I wanted to share these because I feel like I didn't get to, like, really show them that well. So I saved them to bring home because... Yeah, the charger's in the bag. My sister came up with this. I'm, I think she said she saw it on Pinterest and then she ordered these soaps off of Etsy. I'll ask her for the account, but I'm sure if you just like Google or like just search on Etsy floral soaps, these are like uh, fresh flowers or like dried up flowers in soap little things. And I took four of them because I thought they were so cute for the bathroom, but this is really cute. She got these cards made from Minted and that's where I've been doing like a lot of my shower cards and stuff like that. And it says, thanks for coming. And then on the bottom, it says, from my shower to yours. So it's like, you take my soap from my shower to your shower. I thought that was kind of funny. <laughs> and I thought it was cute. So, and then I also saved some cookies. I saved one of each because I thought they were just so pretty. These are my favorite kind of cookies. I feel like they're so yummy. But sometimes I'm like, I never want to eat them because they're so pretty. But we've got Rachel's bridal shower. Almost an autumn wreath. We've got an A. And then got a little champagne glass so that's little details from the shower I'll try to link as much as possible but again my sister did all the planning so if you are interested or want to hire her or whatever I'll have her account linked in the description I just ordered an acai bowl to the house on Uber Eats I don't know why that sounds so good it's like four o'clock in the evening and I was like craving that so I have that um what else do I have I have a lot of boxes and packages, but I think I'm gonna save that for like a little unboxing in the next vlog because I'm vlogging all week again. It's a busy week and we're gonna be filming a lot. So this will be a fun week. This is my first like full week that I'm actually gonna be in Nashville and I'm so excited to be able to just like hang out, relax, work, hang out with Dylan, like not have to worry about packing for another trip. So that's very fun. I also ordered two more pair of 
the local European cargo pants because I normally wear the small medium, but I ordered medium large in the camo color and then the green color. I feel like you guys have seen me wear these like a million times, but I'll show you and I'll also link for you. And I love them like really oversized and loose, especially with like summer or spring being here and summer coming up. They're really cute with like bikinis and stuff thrown over with like slides. So I just like tighten the waist on the medium large. Maggie has the medium large and I wore them in LA and I liked how they fit compared to my small medium. I actually gave my green small medium pair to Lily. So now I have the medium large and then the cargo I heard runs a little big. So I think that these might be a little too big, but we'll see. Uh, I don't know. They look pretty like the, don't look my new camo pants. I can wear them hunting. Oh, nice. There you can but we don't go hunting. I'll show you guys this because I did just unbox it. Daily Drill set. Daily Drills, I'm obsessed with their stuff. I love how they, the two girls are so cute. Her name's Mary Ralph and then I think it's Kennedy. And they recently just started the company and I've been following Mary Ralph before she started Daily Drills. And it's like, I feel like if I had to start a company, it would be exactly like what they're doing. Like, I just love all their stuff and like the way they market and their campaign shoots and all that stuff. I just think that they're literally killing it. So check them out if you don't know what Daily Drills is. They have like a ton of sweat stuff, but recently on Instagram, I saw that I think that they might be dropping swim. So I'm like so excited. I want to order, but they are so kind and they send me stuff and I'm so thankful for it. So they sent this really cute, like um sports bra and their thing is like to always have the daily drills like tag showing so that's really cute and then these like flare um pants sweatpants that have like a seam all the way down them which i love and then they're just flare and then when you roll the waist over it just says daily drills so thought that was cute and then i also got these shoes um steve madden reached out and sent me some shoes and platforms are like super in i feel like they're like super not practical to wear but honestly sometimes sometimes they're actually kind of more comfortable than a heel because your foot isn't like arched as much it's on a platform but look at these shoots they're like super super high just like white platform they like remind me of brad stall heels i don't know how i'm gonna style these or will when or where i'll wear them but i thought they were kind of fun to have in your closet dylan look at how high these shoes are <laughs> i know crazy okay i also just opened this package i had no idea who it was from i like couldn't read the label i was like i don't remember ordering anything from there but i just opened it up and you guys look at these cups <laughs> they are so sick they're um a swarovski crystal like champagne glass for the wedding and she made a mr and miss and this is the company that i got the mrs um cowgirl hat that i wore in cabo and she uses real Swarovski crystals and she gifted these to Dylan and I for our wedding and they're so beautiful and I'm freaking out. They're like so, so good. I'll put her Instagram here, but she can make any type of cup, shot glass, like tumbler, these. She does really, really cool hats. I found her through Kendall Jenner, like through a bachelorette party for one of her friends and I saw that she tagged her on Instagram so I found her page there and she does it really quick, super good shipping and like really good customer service. So highly recommend and I want to Thank her for sending these our way. They're so cute. Is my pizza there? Dang it, my, my, oh, Excuse they put me. mine at the wrong door. Can you go get mine? Because I'm in my room. Are you kidding me? I don't know where it is. I just got a photo. Oh, yeah, that is. Oh. <laughs> Dylan ordered pizza and I ordered oh. smoothie bowl. I'm so excited and I'm so hungry. Let me see that shit. That looks like something I might be stealing from you. Oh, I'm so excited. I got, where is this from? Grain and Berry. It's on, it's in Nashville, obviously. 20 South Ave, I don't know. This is the Grain and Berry Bowl. And I'm so excited, are you kidding me? My nails are so long, I can barely do anything. Here it is. What's our Look at that. 